What's up, guys? <clears throat> this is Neon Dion here with his first video. Today, I'll be bringing you some Clash Royale, some replays, some epic comebacks in Clash Royale history. I'm gonna tag Clash Royale on this, and hopefully, I don't know, hopefully, something happens. Alright, well, first off, right here we have. <laughs> Who do we have right here? The Britain idiot Campbell. Britain. Britain Campbell. He goes to Pleasant Run. What grade are you in? Going to eighth. Alright. And right here we have Isaac Campbell. What grade? Going to fifth. Why are you not smiling? <laughs> you don't wanna see them chompers, boy. Them chompers running the Campbell family. We all know how to look. Alright, but We'll be bringing you some Clash Royale here today, and uh, enjoy. Alright y'all, so like I said, we're here with um, a little Clash Royale. Replays. Um, Alright. Man, I got that generic emote. Alright, so he throws that. While I was playing this game, while I started this game, right before I finished pooping, so I'm finished pooping, I wipe my butt, and he throws out that. So then, I mean, I really didn't place anything, but I'm finished here. Place that on that. Place the air defense. I mean, it's something to answer so the bomber can't hit it because the bomber's actually pretty strong. Um, it doesn't die quick like the regular skeletons, and then like 300 damage per bomb it throws. <clears throat> Throws the Mega Knight out. I, if you look at what I have on my deck, I didn't have anything to place besides that going to these strikes. So does it go for my tower and I get uh, him to take my nail, all that stuff together so I can zap like that. I couldn't use my zap on that Skarmie since I just used it. Stick my tongue out because I was pretty salty that this level 8 is killing me like this. He threw the bomber back out on that. There you go again, spamming these nasty emotes. Put my make me back on it. Uh, we're getting pretty close to double elixir, so that's when I can do my for real golden pushes. Baby Dragon. Alright, this push by him was actually pretty good. But, I am better. So, I'm going to have my towers at 148. And it's going to stay at 148. Boom. Period. Zap. Alright. So, right here. I am... Build up my elixir. <laughs> Patience, goal, band. Alright. It's not how you play against the goal. Because I will do this. And watch how fast I take this tower. Watch how fast the Mega Knight dies. Zap. Okay, you see how I zap that scrum right there? Pay attention because I'm going to need that zap right at the end of the game. But let's see how fast the tower's going. <coughs> Alright. Pick my next goal. I thought I won. I see the say to zap for them. But since he was a level 8, by the time my first push was finished, it was at 1,600. And I had a golem, which could probably kill that tower by itself. But. Since I had 10 licks already saved up, I just went all out. Zap. Bubba Jack. Ball game. He moved to go play, but. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. That was the first replay. A little comeback, you feel me? Next replay.
level 12. He had this is a expo deck. I hate expo decks so bad. When he first did this, I thought he was good, but it was just like a couple misplays by me. He placed that in front of the tower. In front of the tower is really how you can stop a goal and push. Um, so I was just trying to wait that in front of the tower out. But then he does this Expo Rage. It was just really misplayed, misplayed by me. Um, I'm still trying to wait that out. So I'm trying to place my goal when my place is a little too late. Locks on the tower. He notices. He hits the rage. Takes my tower solo. Oh my gosh. And he places barbarians. Who uses those? My dragon finishes off everything. Um, right now he's about 2,200 ahead of me. He's beating me with the elixir. He's got cards on the field. It's not like a too pretty for Lil Yon. Then he presses, oh my gosh. The royal hogs and then like with the golem decks you really don't have things to do splash besides your um, splash damage besides your dragon. So I gotta play that. Eat the damage. Which does a little sum sum right here. Actually a big sum sum, I don't peeped how much that was. Um, didn't have anything to place on the prince. Place my golem there. He plays his expo in defense, which is very good for me. Kill the prince. Um, I think he's gonna, yeah, he's gonna place that in front of the tower. I don't know why. Then I'm gonna use this lightning to hit all three. So the damage I actually came back right here. We're about what, 200 off, 200 and some change. Um, I shouldn't have zapped this, but I do. Um, those guys. Well, I knew I do need to zap them because splash the damage because they have a lot of damage. Um, Royal hogs. They can't do anything but put my lumberjack over there. I'll place my witch again right here. And this, placing that witch again is what helped me win the game. Um, they both, both the witches and the bats, destroy the prince. Um, I lightning to get the infernal tower out of there, and this tower's on 23. You're gonna have a zap, which does 68 damage to a crown or I mean, to a princess tower. And get it out the way. He, uh, if you notice at the end, he tried to put the expo there offensively at the end. A little slow for me. All right, our last replay we have for you today. Um, level 10. I always look at like the levels, like see the King Tower to the Crown is level 10. I always look at that. If they're 10 or 11 or below, I get a little, like I get a little internal hug because I know I can beat those guys. I get a level 12 or 13. Be a tough game. All right, so Pekka. Pekka is another thing that can destroy the gold quick. And right now, he looks like he's about to kick my behind, in which he does. See, I placed that mine right there to destroy that princess, but he didn't. Lumberjack dies quick. Mega Man dies. This is like holy cow. Not even a minute went by, he gets to the tower. Alright. I have to do something to stop this. Madness! I have to do something to stop this madness. Holy cow. Look at that. King Tower. 1380. Level 11. Uh, like right now, not playing this game, I wouldn't even know what to do. Like, right now, I'm thinking. Trying to think about how I'm playing, how I'm playing right now. Don't know. They gotta do something for that princess. He takes that right tower too. I mean, like I had nothing to put on a Pekka with a wizard. If 
if you notice, I took that lightning out of my deck as well. Put the fireball in and took something else out. Put the miner in. Notice the golem on the left side. He didn't place anything. He was just trying to go for a three crown, I guess. Um, 565. Look at that Zapdos. Yeah, zap to slow it down. Golem gets another hit. I got the witch and the lumberjack coming in behind. That tower's down. Put the mine on the king tower because I know that tower's down. Um, princess over here trying to be sneaky. Mega minion. Look at that. Look at that king tower boy going to work over there. Look at that lumberjack. Who we seeing you? You feel me? But uh, yeah. Um, that is what we do in this little class right now. So, um, I'm pretty good. Um, I am Arena 13, Master 3. I'm on my way. I've been playing this game for a couple months now, and I'm actually pretty live. Um, yes, I do. I have spent like, I'm not going to say how much, but I spent some money on the emotes. Cause who doesn't buy stuff on games nowadays? If you don't, you're lame. Um, yeah, uh, thanks Thanks for watching this video. We will be coming at you with some more videos, some better videos. I'm like, this is just my first get first video, get started with you. I'm going to be coming at you with some better videos. Um, you know, um, yeah. Thanks for watching. Peace. Also, I forgot to tell you guys, we have a shout out this video. Lifesaver Gummies. Thank you for sponsoring this video, Lifesavers. Um, you just go to the store, buy Lifesavers, and it helps everybody out. It helps me out with the channel, the promotions, all that. So thank you, Lifesaver, for sponsoring the video. Go get you some Lifesavers. Um, yeah.